Okay, so here's my experience with Dr. Phil. Um, it all came about one afternoon I was out in the trailer and I was just working on some fixing up of things. And I got a phone call from Mike King, who was the investigator on the case about 30 years ago. He's the one that, uh, you know, came in um, and had a team of 70 officers to shut down the Zionist society. So anyway, we'd reconnected after 30 years and I went on his uh, show that he has on YouTube and a lot of people had a good reaction to it. And that's when somebody that he knew said, why don't uh, you go do it on Dr. Phil too? And they knew the same producers. And so he asked if I would be on the show and I was like, uh, sure. And he asked the other girls that were the survivors also of the cult. Um, and we were all children at the time while living there. And there was a lot of child abuse going on in the group. So it was kind of like a, the first personal reunion of all of us together on the same stage, even though it was six feet apart. And um, motorcycle on the left. All right, Much we're on a road trip. We are on a road on trip. On a road trip. Yeah, pulling celebrating. the trailer. Pulling the trailer. Yep. And so I was like, sure, I'll do it. And then after I said I would do it, I was like, oh my God, I don't want to do it. No way. Uh, what? And I, why? I don't want to go and talk about like my biggest, most traumatic things. And then I remembered that I had done, that I'm currently working on a comedy special about the cult and that it's really time for me to empower myself by using my story to help others and also to help others like, you know, feel laughter when I'm doing it in comedy and for them to feel an understanding of what's happening when I'm doing it on talk shows or, you know, talks or something like that. So I was, um, then I, I decided to go. So I went and I did a, uh, COVID test before going, um, before the producers came over to my house for the home interviews. Then they came to my house and did the home interview for one day. And we, they just went through some questions, looked at old photos. I told my story. Pause it was really, for a second. 